this is gonna go perfectly. Kinda wanna have these solid boosters as well here. Just don't know where to put them yet. I kind of like the tricoupler thing, it's pretty cool. Now <laughs> we add a lot of <laughs> steel struts, yeah. We're, we're gonna be adding a ton of these. Tape it together. I hope it actually puts it on the, all those sides. Yes, it does. <clears throat> Wonder if I should have more of these other rockets. And we also need wings. Solids to decouples. Oh, yeah, I didn't. They kind of went somewhere else. Come on. will explode. <laughs> it, it's good health in the skin. It, it, it should explode. I've done too much uh, rocket science in other games to actually make explosive rockets. And uh, now, now doing non-explosive ones is kind of strange. Can I put those in there? No, oh, well, let's put it on the other side. Everyone get to the cover. We'll duct tape these as well. Hopefully when I key couple they actually fly off. And not, not stay together. It's a <laughs> happy package. <laughs> Wrapped together with duct tape. Let's try this lander too. Wings are not straight. Yeah, yeah, they probably are not. Are they not? They look, uh, they look, kind of straight. It's a controlled explosion. <laughs> Sounds like a rocket science to me. Those are... What are, why are they not in the same group? All of them. Hmm. Strange. Oh well, they, they will launch, then...
they will fly, fly to China, the middle ones will... will get in there. And then we kick off that one, we have the outer rockets going, kick off those. Yep, let's, let's see how this new thing works. <laughs> hey Quack. It's still in one piece. Let's see. Well, it's going straight up this time at least. So, there's that. It's going kinda slow though. We may need uh, more power. We'll see. Um, I'll try to fire the middle engines. Yeah, we, we, are, we are definitely not climbing fast enough. I'm uh, from Finland. Yeah, these, these solids definitely don't help us now. Oops. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Let's try that again. <laughs> dum dum dum. Separating your liquids while you are still flying up with them. Mm, not not the best idea. When the solids are close to empty, I'll fire up these as well. Oops. Yet another <laughs> textbook decoupling, yeah. <laughs> this is not going to turn <laughs> to Major Bell. <laughs> yeah. Th there is not gonna be any answer to that call. <laughs> Quack. Let's see if these get us anywhere high from Earth and the blessed flight. <laughs> it just lagged from flying to disaster. <laughs> nice half done skin. Yeah, Twitch has been kinda laggy today and yesterday. It's kinda annoying. I was losing my mind earlier today. Yeah, I'm trying to get the moon. Quack. These are actually taking me pretty nicely into the orbit, it seems. At least, at least for now. I'm not sure about the speed though. Hey Raymond, how's it going? <laughs> yeah, it does, uh, Beard. It's, it's really annoying. I wish there was uh, no delay between the chat and the uh, Streaming, but no. Yeah. Where did you strand it, uh, Rayman? I still have my Bob to rescue as well. 
Tim Moon, nice. They're gonna have to separate again in a second. I'm, I'm not sure if we actually have enough fuel to do this. Thanks, Nexus, for the follow. Yeah, having a burn with these smaller ones is kind of... Uh, I don't know. Stuck for a month. <laughs> nice. Uh, no, I wasn't uh, yet half done skin, but uh, this may be turning into a uh, polar thingy. Because uh, I don't seem to get too up with this. Send an unmanned ship with a regular port, land and then the team fly back. Nice, Rayman. Yeah, Beard, you need to anticipate what's gonna happen. See if I can actually get this to the orbit. Landing is such pain. Yeah, Rayman. Oh crap, it's Jeb actually on the ship. Well, I was not planning to send Jeb. Estimated burn, minute and a six seconds. Yay. Should have started the burn earlier. It's not exactly there yet. Close enough. It's kind of low. Uh, I don't know. Should have probably pushed this a bit higher. Well, I'll. The periaps is a bit higher. Seventy is enough. Yeah, I'm just gonna circularize this because it's not not really circle at the moment. Just gonna turn this wherever that blue dot happens to be there. Three 
three second burn. Hmm. Can I do a three second burn? <laughs> Am I good enough to do that? Yeah, I want to see uh, Nahku build a moon base as well. And I, I want to do a moon base eventually. As well. I uh, just need to actually get to the moon for once at least. Yeah, I know, Raymond. I don't want to do too much quick saving, though. If someone dies, then we'll we'll mess up. What is this, Rayman's link? <laughs> yeah, that is uh, a decent ship. <laughs> I like it. That is, that is pretty neat. That's a lot of rockets <laughs> in there. Uh, what me? What did? What did you do with that one, uh, Rayman? Was that a rescue mission? Flew well too. Nice. Actually, nice to see where the periapsis is now. Hey, Waltway, how's it going? Rescue lander, nice. Yeah, we may be having to do a rescue lander as well at this point, at some point. There we go. Okay. We have a Pretty decent uh, orbit now. It actually doesn't collide with Bill any at any point as well. Now I just need to get to the moon. I'm gonna go to the toilet first though. So I'll just leave you guys with this thing just floating around here. Mm. How is our electricity doing by the way? I guess we are not getting any electricity because we are on the dark side of the planet. We do have uh, solar panels, so it should go fine. I'll be back in a moment. And I'm back. How's it going, Clemorn? Okay. So then we find the moon. That is the moon. And the moon was going this way, yes. If I remember right. <laughs> From the yesterday. Uh, no, not yesterday, the day before. And I needed. Uh, Maneuver node here, I think. And uh, no, not not that way. Hmm. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I like this. <laughs> when it goes this way, does this wrap around the moon? Which one was it? This one? Oh, no. Whoa. Let's do it there. If we fail, we can actually get this home still. Don't understand this game. <laughs> it's a lot of rocket science <laughs> all the way. Uh, I would uh, suggest uh, trying out the game yourself because that's the best way to learn about things. Because just watching is going to be really difficult to understand what's going on. It, it's it's fun. Uh, just uh, ask away uh, if you have any questions. Um, I'm not the best to answer those, but there is uh, other people on the channel, <laughs> like Nahko and Kelemorn and uh, Half Dunskin probably seems to know a lot as well, and many others, so they can answer you better, I guess. It's 22 minutes. 33 second burn. Should be fine. Let's get closer to that one. If it goes all to hell, we can at least get back to home. Or in an orbit around home. <laughs> mm. And uh, if it looks too bad, we'll just do flyby and get the science from that and get home. That's that's fine as well. I was planning to just do uh, flybys anyways first, and uh, then just actually <coughs> trying to do it properly a bit later. We'll just start with this and see see how it goes. No idea, half Danskin. Taking an off takes ton of fuel. Yeah, probably Rayman. If he gets stranded there, it, it is fine. We'll do just a rescue mission later on then. I am from uh, Finland, Michigan. Oh shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oops. <gasps> Minmus is easier to get than Moon. Yeah, I, I know, Beerus. Well, it's, it's fine. We, we'll get to there, in the periapsis, and then we'll maneuver a bit more in there. And if it all goes to hell, we'll just have this nice circle around here, around Kerbin. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I 
When it doesn't uh, make it all the way to a small burn, it'll fix it. Yeah. It should be fine, I, I think. I, I just need to do a nice burn there. You like to do adjustments when you get halfway to the halfway there. Hmm. Interesting, Kelamorn. Just pro a little more, and it should be fine. Pro grade. Uh, which one was that? Tap the gas. Okay. There we go. Thank you. How much fuel do we have, uh, actually? Mm, that's bad. I don't know. Just a flyby would be fine as well. Or a orbit around uh, the moon. Because uh, this is what we did already uh, last time. Um, did a flyby and went back to home and uh, actually landed on the Gerbin. So if I can do orbit around the moon as well, would be nice. This one unmanned. No, Raymond, this is a uh, Jeb there. So Jeb may be the first Kerbal in the moon and will be stranded there. Turn this towards the sun so we get the electricity from the solar panels. Hey Jackbox. This is a Kerbal space program I'm playing. Trying to get these strange green men into the space. Well, he is in the space now and we are actually trying to land here in the moon. Or moon. It's going around here and this is my spacecraft here and it's flying towards here and it's gonna take a turn around the moon. Kerbal assassination program. <laughs> that one also. Uh, killing one. Doing some inventive ways of killing the little green men. Kerbal crash program. <laughs> yeah. So, um, at what point I should uh, do the burn here to actually make the Orbit around the moon. Actually, I can just probably try it. I had a man over there. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, let's, let's try it again. Had a kerb stuck in orbit once. You mean like my SS Red Bull tree here? <laughs> uh, half done skin around uh, Kerbin. There's a bob in the Red Bull there flying around the planet endlessly. Because he ran out of fuel. That was my first orbit ever. Around Periapsis. Moon Peri Burn Retrograde. Okay. It will look strange, but it will snap really fast. Okay, so add maneuver. So I guess that.